Okay, this game is called Guess My Number. So Miss Crick and I have decided that we are going to use numbers up to 30. So I've written the numbers up to 30 on a whiteboard. You could use a piece of paper and a pencil or maybe a notebook. And I'm going to cross off these according to the answers that Miss Crick gives me to the questions that I ask in a minute. Okay, so I need to choose a number between 1 and 30 because that's our range, isn't it? Yeah. So I'm going to write it down here. I'm not going to tell you, Miss Bates. Okay. But I'll show the camera. Okay, I will cover up so I can't see it. Okay, we're ready. Okay, so now I need to ask Miss Crick some questions. So my first question is going to be, is your number an even number? Okay, I know an even number can be split in half using whole numbers equally. So it has to end in a zero, two, four, six, or eight. My number is not an even number. Okay, so because Miss Crick's number is not an even number, I can cross out all of the even numbers on my board. So I can cross out the two, the four, the six, the eight, the 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20, 22, 24, 26, 28, 30. So with that one question, I have crossed out half of the numbers. Okay. My next question. Does your number have a two in the tens column? My number does not have two tens. Okay. Which means I can cross out all of the numbers with two tens. So this time I can cross out 21, 23, 25, 27 and 29 because they all have two in the tens column. Okay, we're getting there. Is your number less than 10? It is not less than 10. Okay, so now we're really getting closer. I can cross out all of the numbers that are less than 10. I know that less than means smaller than, so all of those numbers smaller than 10. So at the moment, I've got 11, 13, 15, 17, and 19 left. Okay. Oh, it's getting trickier now. I need to think of questions. Is your number greater than 15? Yes. So if it's greater than 15, that means it's bigger than 15, which means I have to cross out 11, 13. And I can cross out 15 because Miss Crick told me that it's greater than 15. I've got two numbers left now. I've got 17 and 19. Now, I don't want to just ask Miss Crick, is your number 17 or is your number 19? We want to be left with one definite answer. So I'm going to have to think of a mathematical question to ask Miss Crick. Mm. I've got one. Is your number one less than 20? It's no. not one less than 20. So the number that's one less than 20 is 19, which means, Miss Crick, is your number 17? It was 17. It was 17. Fantastic. So you can play that with any range. You could play 1 to 20, you could play 1 to 50, you could even go up to 100 or you could more. Go up to 100. Um, you've just got to think about how many numbers you've got to write. Yeah. Oh, I liked that game, Miss Bates. It was good yeah. fun, wasn't it? Yeah. Maybe we can play again in a minute. Well, maybe we'll see you in our next game. Thank see you. See you later. Bye.